Hello guys, um, I have something to say, um, I know the ones, there was a fight that I have had yesterday, and sorry for like the tape and the diapers, but I need to keep this anonymous, um, this is a video for some people that I go to school with. Um, I'm for the ones who don't know. I was on the way home from the, from the bus, and let's just say there was a little um, argument, and I got in a fight after I rode the school bus. And you guys saw, if you guys saw my videos, you know I was like super skinny and can't do much. And yeah, but anyway, there for the ones who have witnesses, wis witnessed this. There's something I need to tell you. I have something to say that's important. There is what I did not tell you. One, two, why I got in that fight. And three, why I lost so bad in that fight. Now, I know you see like the, uh, the light back there. I don't know if you see my hand, but um, yeah, that's just to show that I actually am recording. But yes, I'm. Well, yeah, I'm over here. So, um, anyway, the first thing I am going to start with is um, what I did not tell you. Okay, I. Well, let's just start with I am 18. I live in a group home, and I am in a CPS. Um, I know it probably don't look like it, but yes, it is true. Um, and the reason I am saying that, for what I did not tell you, is because when I got in that fight, I got in that fight knowing that I could get locked up. And not just no juvie for eight months, I mean jail for four years, spending my time with what everyone calls Bubba, um, like, I, there's a reason why I still fought, and that needs to be addressed, and that leads us to the next thing, why I fought, so, I'm not gonna leave, I'm, I'm not gonna say his name, or say what he looks like, from the kid that I fought, because it is a respect thing, and I respect him being, having that privacy, um, but there is a reason I fought him. When I was at school, I, I have a friend who has really bad depression issues, and most of my time with her is to make her feel better. Like, I do not like when people get bullied over and over and can't do anything about it because it's, yeah, um, yeah, it's me right there. Um, and this is, the person that I fought is because of this. He, he knows that he, she has depression issues, and he fought her anyway just to make her feel like shit because it makes him feel better. He doesn't know how to express his depression. And that can be another video if you want to know coping skills that actually help a lot. Um, but he was disrespecting them. Uh, he was disrespecting her. And um, a few minutes after that, she came to me during class, told the teacher that she needs to talk to me while she was crying. Um, there's people coming on the bus, but, um, she told me that she was going to kill herself because she is done with this BS. But, um, anyway, um, <laughs> people all around, I'm sorry, I'm a little shy. But, that was one of the main things. I told her who was making her do this, and she said it was that person that I fought. And I do not like when girls get bullied. Um, I like I don't know. Girls deserve respect, and 
to be cared for. Um, but yeah, they deserve to be cared for, and no one deserves disrespect. No one deserves depression, having suicidal thoughts, wanting to kill themselves. Cause trust me, I've been there, and a lot. Um, you. So, I fought him because I am tired of people disrespecting other people and people like getting an enjoyment out of making people sad because that is messed up. So, the reason I fought him was to show him that even someone like me, knowing that they will lose on purpose and take as many hits as possible, is literally because I took those hits for the ones that are getting bullied. I would be the one who would jump in front of someone if they were about to get stabbed, shot, blown up, hit, kicked. You could honestly name it. I'm the one who would stand up for people. Um, and yes, I took those hits for the ones who were getting bullied. I stood up for everyone who was getting bullied because I'm done with that. I care for everyone. Even the one that I got in the fight with. People make mistakes and I realize that. Um, but yes, I took those hits for the ones who got, who, who got, who have been or who are being bullied. Guys, do not be depressed. Stand up, well, stand up in a positive way, I'll say it like that. Do not do anything stupid, but don't feel depressed. You guys are worth more than you think. Everyone is unique. No one is a very bad person or no one is ugly. Everyone's beautiful in their own way. Um, and then th that leads me to why I lost. But yeah, it was kind of self explanatory. The reason why I lost was because I purposely lost so I could show you that, yeah, I'll risk being locked up. I'll risk losing all my reputation and re reputation that I've been growing for a few weeks. I did that because I took the hits for everyone. I care for you guys. Don't give up on like your self esteem. I care about you guys. And I care about everyone I meet. So yes, I took those hits for you guys. Don't feel bad. Everyone is special. You guys are good. Alright. Gotta go. Bye.